Without commitment, you'll never start. But more importantly, without consistency, you'll never finish. Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. Um, it is 9.26 on Tuesday the 8th of March. I've seen people kind of like try and prove the date before. I don't know if this actually proves the date, but that's the date. <laughs> About to get on the scale for the first time at the start of this rolling 72 consistency challenge. Um, I know I'm quite heavy. <laughs> I've just come off holiday. I did overindulge, so I'm going to try not to be shocked. But let me just get weighed. Right. And there we have it. The heaviest I've ever been. 208 and a half right then I'll speak to you in the next clip hi my beautiful people it is um still the 8th of march it's two quarter to three um so i just wanted to come in and check in i thought it would be good if each fast i can kind of give you like a mini vlog um i'm hungry I'm not going to complain about being hungry because I'm choosing to fast and I'm going to fast so there's no point in complaining but I just thought I'd come on and show you the realness of it because my lips are dry I've just had some and water but at the end of the day um I hear the door that's oh, Malachi coming in from work um at the end of the day it's like a lot of people might just think oh people lose weight like that it's so easy but no I want to be like no it's not easy it is hard um and these are one of this is my first day of a 72 and usually the first day i get the most hungry my boyfriend was preparing something to eat um, before he goes to work and i could smell the smells i was just like this is hard but like i said there's no point in complaining if i've decided that i'm doing a 72 i've decided that i'm doing rolling 72s and a couple of 48s what's the point in complaining what's the point in staring at his food and be like oh i'm so hungry there's just no point that's what i wanted to come on and say all right guys it's 8 18 on the 9th of march 2022 um i want to get on the scale now but one thing i want to say is i've noticed that when i hold the phone um that the results aren't accurate so i'm gonna have to put the phone down wait for it to settle and then pick the phone back up okay right here we go there's the scale i'm still here guys don't go anywhere right here we go 205 and a quarter good morning guys it's still the 9th of march it's the morning for editing radio here i just wanted to quickly speak about the last clip that um, you would have seen of me getting on the scale for the second day um, i'm gonna have to cut a little bit of that out and the reason being is when i get on the scale the reflection you can see up my dress um, the reason why i show the date and everything is because i want to prove that i'm being honest um, and I didn't want to do any editing, any clipping, but the truth of the matter is, my weight is what I say it is, I'm not a liar, um, but I have to clip out when I first get on the scale because you do see up my dress and I ain't having it and I'm not re-weighing because I've got a full tracksuit on now and I'm working and I'm not going to get undressed. That was all guys, alright then, resume viewing. Hey there, just checking in, it is half three on the same day, 9th of March. Um, I'm working but I'm very 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 hungry I'm struggling today I'm struggling more than yesterday surprisingly and I just felt like I need to come in and just talk because as I said earlier it's not always easy and I want you to see the parts that you don't normally see now if I'm honest if I wasn't on this challenge I could see myself going into the kitchen and just breaking my fast um, that's why I'm glad I'm doing these things like this help me stay on track I cooked for the family um because we have like a little roll to and it's my it's my day my days are tuesday to friday and so i'm not going to not do it because i'm fasting so i did some rice and some chicken wings and it looks and smells really nice and so it was very 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 tempting um i just i am i'm struggling right now i'm still working i've got about an hour left so what i'm gonna do let me turn the telly down i'm gonna finish work and then I'm going to have a nap because I'm not going to be very productive in other things that I've got to do if I haven't had a nap. I'm just tired, I think, because I went to bed late. Um, and there's always something to do, guys. If it's cleaning, if it's research, um, going to the gym, there's always something to do. Um, and so I decided that I really need to keep busy. That's what I'm going to do. Um, and 
I'll probably the next time I check in should be tomorrow morning when I'm doing my uh, my my way in <laughs> all right then speak to you soon hi y'all I'm back it's still the same day 9th of March but it is the evening time now it's half nine going towards half nine I'm in my bed and I just wanted to show you my fasting schedule you know I love a plan this is just basically breaking down when I'm doing a 72 when I'm doing a 48 when I'm refeeding now there's only about I think three 48s in this plan and I've put the 48s in there because it kind of works around events that I'm going to and things like that but the rest of the time a majority of the time I am doing 72s um yes yeah, so I'm just sharing it with you might somebody might find it useful um it just makes me feel like I'm doing something like I have my plan and, and things like that so I just wanted to share it 8 31 on um, Thursday the 10th of March it's the third day um, happy birthday to my niece Imani. Um, so today is the day that I break my fast. So I'm going to get on the scale. Let's have a look. Remember guys, I'm not going to hold the scale. Hold the scale, hold the phone while I'm on the scale. Because um, it's not an accurate reading there. Right, so I am 201 and a half. So guys, as you've just seen, I'm 201 and a half. Um, and I started it, was it 208? Um, but that was the first day I did hold the phone in my hand regardless it's a nice jump we do know that you know a lot of that is going to be water weight whatever okay I'm 201 <laughs> um I wanted to come on because I haven't actually spoken to you about um anybody who's fasting and that have, might have difficulty so just don't forget that the salt water should be used to help kind of keep your energy up keep your um uh, electrolytes up and all that kind of stuff there um um, also listen to your body guys as much as I really want to get this done and achieved and properly and healthily and safe sorry the cat um, as much as I want to get this all done properly if I'm feeling really unwell there's a bug right uh, there's a bug and she feels like she has to get this bug and all the noise autumn if you feel unwell you must listen to your body I don't care how much weight you have to lose if you are unwell you and you know that you should break the fast break the fast um there was an incident a few years ago I, I believe where I was doing a dry fast and I woke up in the middle of the night and I felt so unwell I was scared I had palpitations I had to break that fast so just listen to your body don't go too far you know your body better than anyone um I'm going to post this video today so that everyone who's fasting with me and people that just want to know can see how the first fast went okay then so the next time i will post i don't see if there's any point in posting after my 48 because i'm fasting tomorrow and then i'm breaking my fast on saturday and then i'm going to do a 72 so i think the next time i'm going to check in will be after my 72 but i'll but i will record the whole experience the 48 and the 72 and so you can see like the two fasts all right let's see. i'm um, about to edit and i just wanted to come back and say this I haven't actually spoke about how I feel. Um, I don't know if it was mainly water weight or what, but I feel very, not very small, because I'm, st I'm still 200 pounds, and the goal is 150. But I just feel a lot lighter. I feel uh, I feel like I look smaller. We, after just a three day fast, that's pretty good, isn't it? So I just wanted to share that. Um, also guys, I know I always say this, but please, can we talk in the comments? We do talk. But I just want more interaction. I want to know how your fast's going. Do you know what I mean? How is your fast going? Um, how do you feel? Any complications? Um, when it comes to refeeding, I'm going to my sister's later this evening for my uh, niece's birthday. Um, so I don't know what I'm going to be eating. But I do know that when I break a fast, I don't focus so much on um, avoiding things. I've been fasting for three days. I'll have a nice meal and then jump back onto my 48. So yeah it's not a, a couple of videos i might um, record um a refeed meal that i'm cooking but because i'm not cooking today there's just no point um guys please can you subscribe if you're not already subscribed and you're returning and you're coming back and you like my content i would really appreciate it it helps me a lot and i am on the road to a thousand subscribers and i really would like to see that anytime soon would be nice just press subscribe just press it won't hurt all right, Sophia, you you forgive me. Editing Radia's back. I keep forgetting things. I forgot to tell you that in the description box, there will be a link to my Facebook group. Um, 
it's called mindset health and mindset coaching i've had it for probably almost a year now but i've not been active in there at all i think i was just a bit nervous to publish it but i do think that now is the perfect time because we're doing this challenge and it'll be nice if we can interact it's a little bit easier to interact on there than on youtube because sometimes i might miss a notification on youtube um we can see how each other are, are doing they support each other so the link to that is below also there is a link to my fasting circle and um, that's something i think it's called life fasting and it's an app you just need to download it uh, the link will take you there um and then within that when you start a fast you just press start and when you end a fast you press end it tells you how long you've been fasting what the body was doing during that time who else is fasting and it's just another place where we can interact and support each other so that's it no more interruptions that's the end of the video now guys um, and i'll see you in the next one